Hello, beautiful souls. This is you putting your effort, your time, your energy into building particular things or into yourself in a way that has radically expanded you. I'm hearing harvest season. Like this is the season of your life to begin reaping what you've been sowing, to get the payout or the payoff in the form of physical manifestation of the things that you've been investing in energetically. Thriving, that word just keeps coming out so strongly. I do feel with the judgment card reversed, there is a very opposite energy attached to you. This is possibly a karmic card, but this feels like it doesn't necessarily need to be a karmic connection. I'm picking up that there is someone who is very opposite of your energy, who is attached to you, specifically through the sacral chakra. So you could be a male who resonates as the divine feminine, and of course vice versa. For some reason, right away I saw a crown, and I'm getting a very royal energy. I'm hearing your soul is like royalty, and I will be channeling more on what I mean by that. Right away, to further channel into that, we have the Nine of Pentacles. I have so many chills reading into your energy. But I'm picking up that you are in this state of power at this time. The word independence is coming out very strongly. So, I feel that for these specific divine feminines I am channeled into here, you may feel as though a major theme of your life, I am hearing recent years of your life, has been a very strong degree of independence or developing a sense of independence within yourself. This means that most likely there's been some kind of physical romantic connection with this person. But this also could mean that they are simply sending you a lot of sacral chakra energy, so they might be heavily attracted to you, fantasizing about you, thinking about you in a physical way that is affecting your sacral chakra. I'm hearing writer's block. So if you have at times been feeling a little bit stagnant in your creativity or when it comes to your art, whatever that is for you, whether it's a business, your work, your passion, a hobby, literal artwork that you do, if you've been feeling some unusual creative blockages or stagnation, it actually could be because of this person who, again, seems to be very, if it's romantic, very attracted to you, if it's platonic, they are just very magnetically drawn to you, really wanting to be in your life. But they themselves are really caught. What I keep getting is like it's kind of complicated because this may not be a karmic connection for you. But this person feels like they're trapped in a lot of karma themselves. So, a lot of people around them may be very karmic. They may live in a very karmically adherent way, meaning they adhere to karmic patterns cycles, addictions, something of that nature. You still haven't gotten a clear scan on your bond with this person. If it's a karmic connection itself, it could be for some of you, or whether this person is just dealing with a lot of karma in their own life, and then their connection to you is causing you to feel some creative blockages as a result of that. From Divine Muscular Type yes, if you believe.